No way. Whether people like to admit it or not, this song, maybe me as a whole, is people's guilty pleasure. This isn't even her song. No one has made this dramatic of a change yet. I think she's a bit delusional. Hey guys, it's Misha and welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be taking a look at Jojo Siwa's new music video. Karma has been out for a little while. I haven't seen it. I'm going to react to it and we'll see what we're working with here. You know, we talked about the lyrics to the video, her rebranding. She has some allegations against her, which you may or may not know about. But yeah, we're actually going to take a look at the video. But before we start, please make sure you are subscribed and have hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. It's like the Bikini Bottom Island. Oh. Wait, I already have something to say. Um, so what's with this kiss makeup? And she has some like fin. Is this supposed to be sea creature inspired look here? All right, now we're on a yacht. No way. Wait, thou shalt not get caught. This is how she felt after saying bitch, right? Karma's a bitch. Oh, she she just um unaligned herself. Why? Oh, she just went for a little swim, okay. And now she's uh moto motoing out of the water. Oh, so now she turned into this like evil fish creature thing because why here's something else i've noticed they all look very young and i know jojo was what like 20 and it's not just about her childlike image that she had before it's just that they all look very young like 16 17 maybe 18 and it's just so weird to see them doing all of that, especially Jojo, because she is doing too much. What was that that she was doing on the island to that poor girl? Who said yes? <laughs> That's a good idea. We will have this island. And Jojo, you're going to be dressed like the Descendants. I think that's another thing. The costumes, like they're all bedazzled, right? They have like rhinestones on them. They just remind you of Disney Channel. So it just feels so wrong to mix that with this sort of dancing. And I don't know what you would call that last bit. Oh, she's back. Okay. interesting she sounds like she just learned how to cuss <laughs> i'm telling a trusted adult about this one <laughs> why did she come out of the water like pennywise yeah that was a very menacing sort of look that she gave us she's trying very hard you know with this transformation to show us that now she's a bad girl, As a bad girl. i mean maybe you are a bad girl if the allegations are true you know the xomg pop members that she allegedly mistreated even after one of them went through surgery and was like bleeding and she's like no you gotta dance so you know yeah maybe she is a bad girl but maybe not quite in the same way she wants us to think she is dream guest on my podcast oh my gosh i mean honestly let's spice things up one of my exes oh she has been promoting this and hyping this up for so long and that's the music video you know, I gotta say, the song itself is not terrible. The video, I just feel bad for the other people on set. Also, why include the lyrics effed around? You can say bitch, but you're not gonna commit to saying fuck around. Just to say effed around, why not just say messed around? And people are also pointing out that the choreography they think is fine, but it's just the way she's dancing, again, doing too much. <laughs> She looks like she is having a medical problem. Karma is a bitch. Like, calm down. And listen, karma is a bitch. If this is what karma does to someone, then do not mess around because you will end up like her. The genre is, I said it back in the day when I first signed with Columbia, I said, I wanted to start a new genre of music. And they said, what do you mean? And I said, well, it's called gay pop. And they were like, what's that? And I was like, it's like K-pop, right? But it's yeah. gay pop. Can't be tamed by Miley Cyrus. Karma, it's that that world of music, Lady Gaga Judas. She's comparing whatever that was 
to those songs. Also, JoJo, I don't think you've created anything new. I think there are plenty of gay celebrities, gay pop stars, and apparently this isn't even her song. It's just a cover. Here's the original. Look at this. Brit Smith, Karma's a bitch, unreleased music video. <laughs> Wait, so the exact same lyrics. So Jojo literally just covered the song and she's out here saying, this is so new. You know, I've never heard of Brit Smith before, but I'm thankful for Jojo for leading me to discover her because this is actually nice. I like this. It sounds good. It sounds way better than Jojo's version. But listen, the lyrics are exactly the same, except she doesn't say effed around. She says messed around. So I think Jojo just added that to make one tiny difference and she couldn't even commit to saying the word. Oh, but she also goes karma. It's karma. And everything else is exactly the same. There's never really been an influencer child star turned into musician adult star. You know what I mean? There's there's never really been this transition. There's been similar. Never someone that was themselves that's making this boom jump transition to also themselves. You know what I mean? And so that's been an interesting vibe. No one try almost every child star ever. Why does she think she's so special? This has never been done. We're gonna make history. history. Only thing that you didn't see that was in the original idea was an element of fire. There was supposed to be a massive element of fire where it was like, I kind of burned the boat and then I kind of burned the island and I kind of like ran away because I set it all on fire with my magic fire powers, I don't know. Anything else? You want to add? Maybe there should have been an explosion, helicopters flying around, Tom Cruise parachuting onto the yacht. How about the cast of SpongeBob rises from the water, joins you on the boat, and you all start dancing? On the video set, though, is when I told the director, I was like, we got to kill the fire. It's never going to work. It's going to be too much. Right. It wasn't already too much. Mm -hmm. Think whether people like to admit it or not, this song, maybe me as a whole, is people's guilty pleasure. And I think that gives us somewhere to go. I think she's a bit delusional. I really do. No one has made this dramatic of a change yet. No one has made, in my generation, this extreme of a switch. And I am the first in the generation. It is very scary, but... Do, 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 do. Someone's gotta do it. But you never know what you're gonna get. Someone is hyping her up too much. I think someone in her life is probably saying, Jojo, everything you do is amazing. This is a hit. This sounds so good. You can do no wrong and no one ever gives her constructive criticism in real life, maybe. I just don't know how else to explain this. This is everyone's guilty pleasure. I've, no one's ever done anything like this. I've learned that if you're proud of it, and you're enjoying it, that is the most important thing. I mean, I learned that lesson when I was 14. Yes, it's important to enjoy it. It's important to feel proud of your work, but also you should think about, okay, anything you post, you have to keep in the back of your mind. Would you be okay with everyone you know seeing this and then some? Your boss, your neighbors, your family, your partner, whoever, they could see that. I just feel like it could have been done differently, even if she wants to go with this bad girl era, bad girl transformation, whatever, which I don't think is really genuine. But even if she wants to do that, I, I just feel like she could have done it differently. She didn't have to dress up like Descendants, like we're watching Disney Channel, but then make it super sexualized. And the way she was talking about this before, promoting it, right? She made it sound like some masterpiece. You know, like this was life changing. You never know what you're gonna get. And that's all for today's video, guys. Please let me know what you think about JoJo Siwa's new music video in the comments below. Also remember to like the video, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. You can also follow me on my other social media platforms that's in the description. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye.